Hello gamers, this is the first time I'm actually seeing this. This is crazy. This is a huge quality of life to the Arcane Labyrinth. Um, so, one of the main uh, criticisms that almost anybody has had about uh, AFK Journey was that if you go to the modes, you know, Legend Trial, I feel like Legend Trial, especially once you can like do harder towers and everything like that, it, it gives a decent amount of rewards. It gives pulls, it gives Tidal Essence, it gives a lot of Purple Essence, and Purple Essence is like the biggest bottleneck in the game. Uh, it's insane. It's a lot. It's really good. Um, as for Battle Drills, Battle Drills are what you do as a part of your guild. It gets you and your guild mates a lot of, uh, a lot of rewards. That is very good. Okay, good. My team actually defeated that. That's awesome. I got it really low earlier. Um, other modes, uh, arena, really good, really important. You can get, uh, you can get copies of S tier characters from the Emporium based on what you do here. Uh, you get insane amounts of rewards. Yeah, you can, you can just get a ton of these. You can get, uh, these pulls for the Hypogen characters and that's weekly. And I think this is actually brand new too. The fact that you can buy five of these pulls, that is insane. That is a game changer and will definitely help. Uh, everybody on their way to getting a Hypogean character, which uh, mostly, by the way, if you don't know this, the one you should be going for first is Reiner. Um, the second best one is, I can't remember her name, but it's the angel lady with the big sword who flies up into the air and like helps your team from above um, and like drops big stuns on your team. Anyway, um, Honor Duel. Honor Duel is, it's really, it, it's okay, um, but it has weekly rewards which are pretty decent. You get 500, ge no, 700 gems from that. You get a bunch of gold, which is like pretty whatever. You get a lot of gold in this game, uh, but you get some pulls and that's just weekly. There was an event going on where you got a Parisa skin. Actually, that might be still what's going on for 11 days and 19 hours. I, I don't actually know, but Honor Duel is very fun and it has a pretty decent amount of rewards. And then Dream Realm is one of the most rewarding things in the entire game. You get this uh, Dream Fragment uh, Essence, to get once you get dream fragments you can go to the emporium and you use them to buy copies and we, you can buy a lot of copies every month of uh a tier characters and this is 15 copies of any character that you want i got all of od's copies and i'm working on merrily's copies it is extremely extremely valuable i think i'm going to go for parisa as well um now that my od is uh mythic plus um it gives you really good gear that's usually above your level. If I got this, this would definitely be above my level. I got this. This was above my level. This is like the only piece of 200 gear I have. And then at the very end, once you 100% a boss, you'll go to the next difficulty where all these rewards reset for each of the percentages and you can get three pulls. And then you can work on getting the next group of rewards. Also, every day, depending on you know how you did, what your ratings were um, for you know, your place in your, your server for how much damage you did, you can get daily rewards such as more dream fragments than other people. If you place lower, um, you get temporal essence and tidal essence, which is really good for upgrading characters in the really high highs. You can get even more of all those things and you can also get really cool titles, which are really nice. Um, everything has a decent amount of rewards. AFK stages is how you naturally get more and more resources it's your it's your highest uh look it's your best location to get the most amount of resources in the game the afk stages those are very rewarding the only thing i'm sorry for yapping for four minutes by the way i'm just building up to this um the only thing in the game that was really really not that rewarding was arcane labyrinth it was rewarding enough right for me personally i believe to go through each of the clears once because like three and three uh, epic invite letters that's pretty cool um, even in this one, you had 600 hero essence. This one, you had 400 hero essence. This one, you had 200 hero essence. I don't know why that ended. This one should be 800. This one should be 1,000. This one should be 1,200. It, like, it goes on and on. It should be there. I don't know why the essence was removed for the first clear rewards after, like, the first few stages. I don't think it ever comes back. No, it doesn't. But finally, finally, at least, we have weekly labyrinth quests um we we have a weekly amount of points that we need to reach this is something that i don't know if it was an afk journey so i can't make the comparison to there 
this might be a thing in AFK Journey. In fact, I'm pretty sure it is. I've heard it, I think. But if it's not, whatever. I haven't played AFK Journey. But I know that this is in Honkai Star Rail for a simulated universe. And it's very, very good. It is a reason for you to come in every week and do the content, even if you've already completed it once before in the past. Right? There would be no reason for me to even touch Labyrinth between difficulties. There is literally no reason, because the only thing that was in the game was the first clear rewards. So I'm just trying to work on getting another Mythic Plus Hero, and then finally I, I can unlock Arcane Labyrinth difficulty 11, get my three epic invite letters by spending like 15 minutes in the mode, and then never touch it again until I finally I have, um, you know, what I need for difficulty 12, which I already do. So like that's, you know, a botched example. But then I would just stop and then I wouldn't have anything to do until difficulty 13 until I reach the requirements for that. So I need another Supreme Hero, I need a Resonance level 170, and I need to clear difficulty 12. Right. So we only had the first clear rewards before, but now we finally have weekly rewards. What the weekly rewards, I did the math, hold on. I don't want to have to do that right in front of you. I did, it. Uh, it's eight pulls. This is assuming you have all 15 stages. That's not going to be the case. So whatever stages you haven't reached yet, just subtract that from the totals I'm going to about to give you. But not even I have all 15 stages. But if you did, right, so to speak, um, so to say you had, you know, all 15 stages, you can get up to, you go up to 6,000 points and you can get eight pulls, 360 diamonds, and 40 title essence. 360 diamonds is pretty whatever. Eight pulls is, it's okay. It's okay on the standard banner. It's not even on the epic banner, but it's on the standard banner. Um, eight pulls, 360 diamonds, and 40 of the most basic essence. It really is whatever. Like, this is not a lot of rewards by any means, but I haven't played it yet. I don't know how easy it is to get it. If it's, you know, because you unlock this at difficulty 10, if I do one match of difficulty 10, or if I, yeah, if I do one run at difficulty 10, and it unlocks all the weekly quests up to difficulty 10. So it takes like 15 minutes and I get all of these rewards here. That would be, that would be insane. I mean, insane. it's, it's a very low time investment and considering if that would be the case, right? That's actually a lot of rewards for the amount of time investment. So, and you only have to do it once a week, right? You only have to fulfill this goal once a week. So I actually think this is extremely good for the game. I really like that they did this. I wish that there was maybe a little bit more rewards, and I still wish we had more essence in the first clear rewards. Um, it is obvious that uh, hero essence is one of the it, it, it is the biggest chokehold in the entire game. Um, uh, it, it's like, yeah, it, it's what you get stuck on the most. I can't think of the word. It's not chokehold, but yeah, it, it's a choke point. It's the biggest choke point of the game, um, but overall, I wish they would add that to the first clear. I don't see why not. Even at this point of like stage 11, where I would get like, I don't know, like 1,400 purple essence or whatever it would be, whatever it would math out to. I'm not going to do the math again. Um, that is not, it's not even enough to upgrade one character. And even if I did get enough to upgrade one character, Come on, man. Can I upgrade one character? You know what I'm saying? Like, it's not a lot. I just wish that it was there because this mode is really fun. I really like doing simulated universe in Honkai Star Rail. Uh, it's a lot of fun. So, you know, roguelites, they're very, very fun. So I wish that they would do a little bit more, but this is an incredibly good step. Thank you all for watching. I don't know if we made it there. No, no, no. We didn't make it there yet because I'm going to upload this video right away because it's something brand new that I just found out about. Um, and I'm pretty sure that it just dropped like very, very recently because I didn't see this ever before until just today when I logged in. Um, as well as the, the five Hypogean pulls on the arena uh, for the arena tickets weekly. That is also insane. Um, I just saw that today. So I'm going to upload this video like right after I'm done recording it just so I can get the information out there. And let everybody know what I think about it. So we haven't hit 2,000 subscribers yet is basically what I'm trying to say. We are really, really close. We're six subscribers away at this exact moment. And if you subscribe, you can get me over the line. That'd be really cool. Thank you all for watching. Like the video if you like it. Comment down below how you feel about the rewards in Arcane Labyrinth. Is this enough? 
would you like to see more in my opinion you should always want to see more these companies are very rich okay they're not going to be losing out on a ton of money if they give you a little more okay that's that's the golden rule okay be happy be kind of happy with what you have unless it's nothing and then still ask for a little more okay anyway i'm done ranting all right see ya. i'm i'm done rambling